Hello guys, in this video, you will see how the cast of the All in the Family TV series from 1971 to 1979 changed. You will know their real names and age, and today, let's see what all of the All in the Family stars look like now versus when they were on the show. Don't forget to like and subscribe to our channel. Let's get started. Number 1. Carol O'Connor as Archie Bunker Famous for his gruff, ignorant, bigoted persona, African-Americans, Hispanics, Communists, Hippies, Gays, Jews, Catholics, Women's Libbers, and Polish Americans were frequent targets of his barbs, Archie Bunker was in fact a complex character. Archie Bunker was portrayed as hard-working, a loving father and husband and a basically decent man whose views were merely a product of the era and working-class environment in which he had been raised. Nevertheless, Archie was bad-tempered and frequently told his long-suffering scatter-brained wife, Edith, to stifle and dummy up. Archie Bunker was played by Carol O'Connor when he was 44 years old. Sadly, O'Connor died at the age of 76 on June 21, 2001, in Culver City, California, from a heart attack brought up by complications from diabetes. Number 2. Jean Stapleton as Edith Bunker Edith Bunker is Archie's ditzy but kind-hearted wife. Archie often tells her to stifle herself and calls her a dingbat. And although Edith generally defers to her husband's authority and endures his insults, on the rare occasions when Edith takes a stand, she proves to have a simple but profound wisdom. Despite their different personalities, they love each other deeply. Stapleton developed Edith's distinctive voice. Edith Bunker was played by Jean Stapleton when she was 45 years old. Sadly, Stapleton died of natural causes at her apartment in Manhattan on May 31, 2013, at age 90. Number 3. Rob Reiner as Michael Meathead Stivic Gloria's Polish-American hippie husband is part of the counterculture of the 1960s. While good-hearted and well-meaning, he constantly spars with Archie, and is equally stubborn. Although his moral views are generally presented as being more ethical and his logic somewhat sounder, Michael Meathead Stivic was played by Rob Reiner when he was 24 years old, and now he is 75 years old. Number 4. Sally Struthers as Gloria Bunker Stivic Gloria Bunker Stivic has the generally kind nature of a mother but the stubbornness of her father, which early in the series manifests as childishness, later as more mature feminism. Gloria frequently attempts to mediate between her father and husband, generally siding with the latter. Gloria Bunker Stivic was played by Sally Struthers when she was 24 years old, and now she is 75 years old. Number 5. Mike Evans as Lionel Jefferson His character is significant for being one of the first TV portrayals of a young, opinionated black man. Lionel Jefferson is the son of George and Louis Jefferson, the black next-door neighbors of the Bunkers, and a good friend of Gloria and Mike. Lionel Jefferson was played by Mike Evans when he was 22 years old. Sadly, Evans died of throat cancer in his mother's home in 29 Palms, California, at the age of 57. Number 6. Isabel Sanford as Louise Jefferson Louise Jefferson was similar in many respects to the character Edith Bunker. Both were kind-hearted and had hot-headed husbands, and they were both good friends. However, Louise was not nearly as naive as Edith. Louise Jefferson was played by Isabel Sanford when she was 54 years old. Sadly, in September 2003, Sanford underwent preventive surgery on her carotid artery. In the ensuing months, 
Her health steadily declined. She was hospitalized at Cedars Sinai Medical Center on July 4, 2004, where she died five days later, a month before her 87th birthday. Number seven, Alan Melvin as Barney Hefner. Barney Hefner was Archie's best friend and a regular at Kelsey's bar. Barney first appeared in 1972 as a recurring character. His appearances increased during subsequent seasons until he became a regular. He appeared as a regular in all four seasons of Archie Bunker's Place. Barney Hafner was played by Alan Melvin when he was 48 years old. Sadly, Alan Melvin died of cancer on January 17, 2008, aged 84, and was buried at Westwood Memorial Cemetery, Los Angeles. Number eight, Jason Wingreen as Harry Snowden. Harry Snowden is a bartender at Kelsey's Bar who continues to work there after Archie purchases it as his business partner. Harry had tried to buy the bar from Kelsey, but Archie was able to come up with the money first by taking a mortgage out on his house, which the Bunkers owned outright. Harry Snowden was played by Jason Wingreen when he was 58 years old. Sadly, Wingreen died of natural causes at the age of 95 at his home in Los Angeles, California, on December 25, 2015. Number nine, Danielle Brisboa as Stephanie Mills. Stephanie Mills is the cute nine-year-old daughter of Edith's cousin Floyd, who is a regular throughout the ninth season. Despite being cute and having a sweet side. She is smart and clever, and does give her own few remarks at Archie from time to time. The bunkers take her in after her father abandons her on their doorsteps in 1978. Stephanie Mills was played by Danielle Brisboa when she was nine years old, and now she is 53 years old. Number ten, Betty Garrett as Irene Lorenzo. Irene Lorenzo is a liberal friend of Edith Bunker and wife of fellow liberal Frank Lorenzo. They are neighbors who lived down the street from their bunkers. Irene, being a handy man of sorts with her own tools that she carried in her purse, fixed a broken wire on their bunker's living room phone that Archie had a hard time fixing himself. Irene Lorenzo was played by Betty Garrett when she was 54 years old. Sadly, Garrett died of an erotic aneurysm in Los Angeles on February 12, 2011, at the age of 91. Number 11, Sherman Hemsley as George Jefferson. Like his neighbor Archie Bunker, George Jefferson was frequently opinionated, rude, bigoted, prone to scheming, and not particularly intelligent in a scholastic sense. But still a loving, hardworking father and husband. Unlike Archie, however, George was quicker thinking and usually cleverer. George Jefferson was played by Sherman Hemsley when he was 35 years old. Sadly, on July 24, 2012, Hemsley died at his home in El Paso, Texas, at age 74. The cause of death. Was giving a superior vena cava syndrome, a complication associated with lung and bronchial carcinomas. Number twelve, Danny Dayton as Hank Pivnik. Hank Pivnik, a loyal friend of Archie, is somewhat of a big practical joker, as shown in the episode Archie's Other Wife, in which, with the doing of him and Pinky Peterson, another practical joking buddy of Archie. Archie, after passing out drunk, awakens next to an attractive young black woman, who claims that they were married. Hank Pivnik was played by Danny Dayton when he was 53 years old. Sadly, on February 6, 1999, Dayton died of emphysema in Los Angeles, California. We really love the cast of the All in the Family TV series. Thanks for watching, guys. If you like this video, please like, comment, and share it with your friends. And don't forget to subscribe to our channel.
See you on the next video.